Today's horoscope and tarot reading from Astro Academy, Aries March 22, 2022. The moon spends the day in your sector of work, health, and duties, encouraging your interest in straightening out your life. However, the sun is moving into alignment with Jupiter in your solar house of joy and creativity, opening you up to enjoying yourself more fully. It's about your heart's desire or heartfelt endeavors, passions, and loves. If you are doing something creative, it's bound to be spirited. You can see benefits to romantic matters. It's also a time for feeling especially optimistic and possibly quite passionate and creative. There is a larger-than-life element to your feelings and desires today and tomorrow. Self-expression, personal magnetism, and confidence are themes. You might awaken to hidden or dormant talents. Getting your fitness on before a night out on the town? You're a whole mood, and your love life is no exception these days. This is especially true when considering Jupiter-Neptune in Pisces, bringing expansion and magical inspiration to your romantic fifth house of love, passion, pleasure, and self-expression. Although, with today's moon transiting through warrior-like Aries and your health-conscious sixth house of daily routines, chances are you're some time to invest in yourself, even if that means putting your notifications on silent for the time being. However, be sure to check your messages, as Mars-Venus will continue to charge up your interpersonal exchanges. Work with your favorite colleague today. As the Sun in Pisces sextals Uranus in Taurus, you may feel inspired to team up. The Sun motivates your desire to indulge in your creativity and imagination, while Uranus is shaking up your professional commitments. So, you may find a unique way to go about your obligations. You could also pair up with an unlikely coworker or client to execute something truly magical. Whatever you do, go into it with a hopeful perspective. The lovely sextile is perfect for having fun with your projects and co-workers. Even the money gods are behind a call to have your work rather than your money hat on today. With the moon returning to your financial sector early next week money matters can wait while the moon's last visit to your work sector before the sun returns is just what untapped income potential has been waiting for. Today is all about trusting your gut on the job front. If your boss is driving you nuts, make fun plans for after work to blow off steam. Throw the stress into the recycling bin and head for a karaoke bar. You may hit a wall today. That is, whatever you are trying your hardest to accomplish could reach a climax of some kind. Maybe you will break through, maybe you will break down. Be prepared to meet the challenge or the celebration with a steady grasp on reality. Be especially attentive to your needs while you work. Drinking water throughout the day is a must. Examine your desk chair and computer setup. Is it ergonomically correct? These kinds of considerations will steer you toward greater awareness of what's to come. Knowing when to call it a day and relax for a while can be challenging for you on this day. Given your energetic and ambitious nature, the added charge from the dedicated and hard-working day should see you going like nobody's business. The question of whether or not you will get things accomplished today is not an issue. But whether or not you'll take care of yourself by balancing things out after hours can be. Make plans for some down time too. The moon is not only already in your relationship sector ahead of tomorrow's full moon but is already making its presence felt, as it finds itself in the wrong place at the right time. Before the moon can clash with the sun in Pisces tomorrow, it clashes with Mercury here today, stress testing a balance between your personal and relationship needs. However, not only is Mercury the planet of communication but the moon's friendly aspect to planets in your communication sector was always going to give you the support to give anything exposed a voice. While the moon won't clash with the sun to create a full moon that will see your personal and relationship needs clash until tomorrow, it is already in your relationship sector and is already making its presence felt. While a clash with Mercury could create some tension, as the planet of communication he was always going to use this to get the communication lines open. A friendly aspect to planets in your communication sector will make this even easier. 
Your tarot reading for today. The world, the moon, and the hanged man. Your current employment situation tends to limit you in your future plans. This is bad for you and those around you because you are unable to be happy and you can take it out on others who, however, are not to blame. Your days are not easy, and you feel moody at night. Your bad mood is contagious and will rub off on the people close to you even though they don't deserve it. Learn to deal with your emotional state and keep it to yourself. Of course, your situation is not simple, but neither is anyone else's. Keep it to yourself and work on ways to make things better. The main problem, according to the cards you drew, is that you don't dare to try new challenges. Sometimes we have to launch out into the unknown, to experience new things, to push our limits, and to grow professionally. This is especially true if you have always worked in the same industry, in the same sector, and today the job opportunities are no longer the same in that sector. You have to be open-minded and learn new things to become competitive in the new sectors that are offering better jobs. If you succeed, your family and friends will be proud of you and you will have transformed your professional problem into a wonderful asset. You have everything to gain, so don't hesitate, get started. You still have time, everything is possible nowadays. Our eyes in the sky. When the moon squares Venus this morning, we're likely to crave affection and intimacy. If you have a partner, you have to be cautious that you don't get too wrapped up in what only you want. If you're solo, there may be a feeling of loneliness at this time. The moon makes this a great time to find neutral territory with others as well, so don't be too pushy or you could miss out on a new experience. Later in the morning, Venus moves into bold Aries, and we find ourselves really going for what we desire in a whole new way. There are no apologies and few reservations about telling it like it is. This evening, Mercury sextals Uranus, bringing stimulating conversation and some unexpected detours. Trying new things is something of a theme for the day and highly encouraged at this time. Finally, Tonight's Mars-Saturn trine provides perseverance for anything that requires endurance and ambition for any goal that you're chasing. This transit also bodes well for work matters and family relations. What you want to do most in this nurturing lunar energy is wrap everyone up in a big giant hug. That gives you reason to cling to the ones you're able to be around all the tighter and be thankful for the personal connections you have been able to maintain in your life this last year. If you're able to cook a comforting meal for your family or to make your home relaxing and inviting, those are both great uses of your domestic energy today. The moon sextals progressive Uranus late tonight, bringing a hopeful feeling that maybe things will change soon. You don't have to wait for things to happen during this aspect, either. If you want to do something differently, go for it. Tonight's forward-focused energy supports you trying something new, going out of your routine and doing whatever it takes to make positive changes for your future. Your stronger-than-normal intuition can be an excellent guide if you listen to it closely. Your innovative, experimental nature tonight is a great complement to your agile mental reflexes and your accurate gut instincts.